development fortunes of every economy and for Ghana is for academia to train the youth with critical thinking skills, problem solving abilities, time management amongst others. He posited that traditional universities have their mandates of providing knowledge-based skills for companies, while technical universities provide applied and research-based support for same. There's a need for technical universities to concentrate on their core mandate of training the youth to develop technical skills and competencies to feed the industrial operations for the development and growth of the country. For Professor Mate, it is worrying that some technical universities are admitting high numbers of students into humanities instead of applied and technical fields. He, however, commended the Accra Technical University TU for staying focused. The Minister for Education, Dr. Yaose Educhum, urged universities to arrange with companies for campus recruitment. If people are recruited directly, we should find a way for them to do their national service concurrently while they embark on a full-time employment with companies that need their services. That is what will encourage companies to come here and recruit. The ATU Vice Chancellor, Professor Samuel Ni Odai, said the university has chalked up some successes over time. The school acquired accreditation from the FDA to manufacture PPE and hand sanitizers, amongst others, at the peak of COVID-19. It also procured enough furniture for the school. The ATU has launched an Enhancing Student Experience Fund to support the needy. Our departments of fashion design and textiles also designed and sold 250 beautiful academic gowns worn by our students. 3,956 students graduated with degrees, diplomas and certificates.